Hey everyone, it's Kelly. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my new subscribers and another edition of Snow Days with Kelly. This has been such a fun series that I started here on my channel last month to incorporate my love of snow. I absolutely adore winter. It's my favorite season. Of course, I'm in one of the hottest states in the U.S., so if you have any extra snow that you don't want, I will take it. Please send it my way. <laughs> that is why it has been so much fun doing this series because it gives me the opportunity to have some little snowy play through paper crafting. It's also been amazing because I've had some super fun friends join in with their creativity and their amazing talent to do some creative snow play as well. And I will have them all linked in the playlist so you can check it out. This week, I have a guest joining me and she is another Kelly. That's right. It's Kelly Squared. She's Kelly's craft and I absolutely adore her. She's one of my very sweet friends and she is linked in the description box below. So please go check her out and show her some crafty looks love and see what she has created today. She is super talented and we have a lot of fun doing a lot of things on Instagram together. So I'll go ahead and link my Instagram below as well. If you want to give me a follow, I will definitely follow you back. But I post some things there that aren't on my channel and vice versa. So you can check out all of the things that I do that I create. Jumping in, I am so excited. I was actually inspired by something that I created for Shaker Sunday and that was this sweet little snowman with the Santa in the back. I was inspired by the colors, the whole idea, and this circle. That's right. I decided to do a little thrift flip this week, and I did create this gorgeous little altered camera. It did go slightly off rogue, <laughs> off the beaten path, but that's okay. I was able to circle back around and make it work. This is so much fun. My little granddaughter had asked for a, not a Santa cam, but one to take pictures of the elf on the shelf because it has been doing some fun and creative things <laughs> and yes I've been helping with some of those so I have this Dollar Tree camera so I have several of these and I decided to do a little flip so that she could use the camera to send some photos back to Santa Claus of what the elf is doing and I thought that would be super cute this week to do this for my snowy day play one of the things about snow day play that I'm trying to incorporate with this series <clears throat> excuse me is that these are things, <coughs> oh, I'm so sorry, things that you can do in your own home, not just on a snowy day, maybe it's a rainy day, maybe you just want an activity. So these are things that you can do at home with your friends or just create on your own, do it with your children, your grandchildren, whatever you would like. Most of the things you'll have in your house, you'll have the glue, you'll have the paper, you'll have all of those things. It's just putting them all together and having some creative ideas. Maybe you don't know what to create. So this is just like a little idea of something that you could do. Next time you're at Dollar Tree, go ahead and pick one of these up. They are so fun to flip. And this is just a little camera frame. So this is what I did. I took some paper from uh, Recollections Pack. I love, love this. Had little peppermints on it. I wanted to incorporate a little fun and a little festivity so it doesn't have total, total snowflakes. That's why I said it went a little bit rogue. I did use, these are from Crate Paper. I've had these in my stash for years, a long, long time. It's a super cute little set. Love this little reindeer. Look how adorable it is with the pinks and the purple and that blue little Santa Claus. It has almost like a retro, very vintage look to this set with the colors. It's very modern, super adorable. I love, love that. So I decided to go ahead and use some of those. You can see these snowflakes back here as an ornament. This little snowman, love that one most of all. I did use a, a rosette, did not make this one. This one is from a set from Dollar Tree. Here's a greetings, another snowflake. And because it had these little peppermints, I went ahead and put the candy cane on here. Peppermint candy canes made with love and another snowflake. And all I did was, you can see here, it is a natural colored wood. I went ahead and painted it white, so it has white all the way through. And then on the back, just put a little um, thing to cover up in case it comes open with best wishes. And then another little snowflake. On the inside are some of those perler beads, the ones that we were looking for in Dollar Tree. And they look like this. I just literally dropped this box. <laughs> I think I might have broken a hinge. They are these ones here. I used the ones that were in white. These are also another great idea to use. So if you have the diamond dots, that would also be perfect. Let's see if this will close. I literally just dropped this as I was bringing it to the desk. Ah, oh, there we go. Yay. 
success. So that is what I created for the snow and that is the faux snow inside. The uh, little beads are supposed to, you know, emulate the snowflakes and this little snowman. So I love, love this. I think she'll have a lot of fun with this as well. Again, we're going to do a little Santa cam, but for now she can just take little pictures and pretend that she is taking pictures <laughs> of the elf on the shelf and all of the fun antics. That's going to be it for this one. Please go check out Kelly. She is linked below so you can show her some crafty love. Thank you, sweet friend, for joining me this week. I am absolutely blessed that you are having uh, a snow play day as well. And that's going to be it for this one, my friends. I think I'm going to do this series once a month. I think it's going to be a lot of fun to do something in January as well and maybe even all the way to like February do something with love once a week I think this is going to be something new on my channel heading into 2023 so stay tuned it's gonna be a lot of fun heading this way as always if you like my content please consider hitting that like button subscribe right up there with your bell notifications on and I'll let you know that I have a new video up leave me a comment helps me find your channel as well made a lot of new friends that way that's going to be it for this one. Come back soon. I have a package to open with you and I have some more hauls coming up so you won't want to miss those. And that's going to be it for this one. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.